This house is built on a large residential plot of land that accommodates four buildings. All species of the Sonado still preserved endorse the idea of taking care so that this bucolic environment is preserved after the future buildings and some paved external areas are built. From the beginning, in all interventions, we sought to avoid that the future residential complex would be configured as a group of four houses separated by streets and sidewalks completely paved, as are the topologies of the limited lots in the large Brazilian cities. In this way, the created urbanism is not only defined by streets and sidewalks, but by a wide area where greenery and pavements are used for the enjoyment of pedestrians, wheelchair users, children in squares, and winding paths in mosaics and designs harmonized with the previously existing natural species and the newly implanted ones. The structure of the entire residence is in reinforced concrete, with solid slabs or mixed with ceramic elements, in order to accentuate the lightness of the upper volume. Over the elements of the ground floor, we created some cantilevers at both ends and slits secured. With transparent glass in the openings between floors, the final result gives greater autonomy to the ground floor and the upper floor, as well as reaffirming the expected lightness for the entire work. The entire social area extends to the outdoor living area, a veranda marked by a delicate metal cover and the pool planted in the landscaping of the large plot. Although it is a two-storey house, it is possible to notice that the resulting composition of its volumetry tirelessly sought a design, whose scales between natural greenery and constructed elements did not pose any threat to the bucolic scale of the lush greenery of that entire region.